Well, a whole new sport has come to the Tri-State, and if you like being on a golf course but you don't really want to invest all the time and the money it takes to play, this might be for you. Yeah, it's called foot golf. The rules are similar to regular golf, but the balls are harder to lose. Local 12's Paula Toti introduces us to the sport breathing new life into the golf course business. All right, first of all, I've got to tell you straight ahead, I did not know what assignment I'd have today, so I did not bring the proper footwear for foot golf, but here goes. You kick the soccer ball just like you would if you were playing soccer. The idea is to move it down the fairway and get it into the holes that look like this. You'll find these specially designed holes about every 80 yards. An average foot golfer can play the, bat, the whole 18 in two hours. Where, and that's why we can integrate them so well, is that they move along with the golfers and they actually just, the golfers are respectful, they're respectful and they just move along just fine. The golfers don't seem to mind at Vista Verde Golf Club in Liberty Township. If someone is playing ahead of you, you wait a few minutes to tee off or kick off and share the course. The faster pace allows for a whole new revenue stream with people able to play just a few hours before dark. Foot golf is gaining popularity around the country at a time when the golf business has seen a decline of about 5 million golfers in the past few years. Even local courses have closed. Crooked Tree in Mason closed. That was our home course, and uh, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with golf. As much as Troy Jackson loves golf playing every week, he's up for a try at foot golf. It seems interesting. I definitely want to want to try it out. You like soccer? I love soccer. And it's pretty fun. It's awesome. You know, it's a little challenging at times, but definitely a good combination of soccer and golf together. Take it from two guys who love both sports and can definitely kick the ball with skill and dress the part. To wear your polos, Argyle socks, almost like you'd look at a golf course, but a little bit of soccer thrown in. About 130 golf courses in the U.S. have now turned to foot golf as a second source of revenue. They've been putting it in the hole for the last couple of years in Europe, a little ahead of us. So can't you see a time when we have a World Cup of foot golf? In Liberty Township, Paula Toti, Local 12 News. I don't know, that might be a stretch, but we'll see. Vista Verde has uh, its official foot golf opening July 26, playing nine holes, about 10 bucks with a cart, without a cart, sorry. Green Crest Golf Club, also in Liberty Township, will open to foot golf in the coming weeks. That might be